We are here on day one of Wolf Cop. It's very windy and very cold, but we are warm in our hearts. Prop sandwiches are the best. <laughs> God knows what they put in them. One of the cool things on uh, Wolf Cop the movie is we're back in the same bar where we shot the trailer. It's a bar called McNally's. They've been really nice to us and they've let us come back in here and turn it into the Tooth and Nail Tavern, which is a fictional bar in our movie. And they've created a really cool, dank, neon-y, small town bar vibe. You, you gotta check it out, it's amazing. So much neon. This film isn't really set in the real world per se. It's more like a slightly heightened reality comic book movie. So it was really important in those first couple days to get everybody in the groove, set the tone for the performances, for the crew, and all that, and keep ahead of the curve and make our day, while still getting really good stuff. We are setting up for one of our many Lou, aka Lou Garu, aka Wolf Cop, sitting at a bar, getting drunk. However, this will not be a normal getting drunk. This is a very weird getting drunk. I've said too much. Robertson, Cops Master, actor, voiceover extraordinaire, lazy. Cut, great, let's do it again with blood. I was very nervous on the first day. It really hit me that there was gonna be no easy days on Wolf Cop. Every day was gonna be a struggle, but luckily I, I was surrounded by really great people. So I knew that we had a fighting chance. <laughs> Show's over. <laughs> I just started my shift. Up until that point, I really thought things were gonna go well, and then they took a little bit of a turn.